Pray without ceasing. In these strange times when we can't be together in person, it seems all the more important that we be together in spirit by praying for each other. And if you've ever been intimidated by prayer, then here is a short prayer you can memorize and use for whenever you randomly think of another person. And in that way, we can be there for each other even when we can't be here for each other. And then we can truly pray without ceasing. God, as I hold a moment in my thoughts, I ask that you would hold them eternally in yours, remaining ever at work in their heart and life, even now directing their paths toward your good ends. Amen. One way to approach memorization is to look for similarities and so right away I see that the person praying is holding someone in their thoughts and they're asking God to hold someone in God's thoughts. The person praying is holding that person in their thoughts only for a moment, but as God is outside of time, God holds that person eternally in God's thoughts. It's difficult to find a mnemonic device for the second half of the prayer, so in that case, just repetition, repetition. I once put the entire communion liturgy on my car dashboard so that I could memorize it, not while driving, but while sitting at stoplights. That is a great place to keep running your eyes over something that you're trying to commit to heart. Of course, your bathroom mirror, so every time you're brushing your teeth, you're running these words over in your mind. Then that way, Anytime you need a prayer at a moment's notice, you have one ready. I'm going to give this example of people I've been praying for this week and use the repetition of this prayer to try to cement it in your memory and mine. So please join me in prayer. God, as I hold Anna a moment in my thoughts, I ask that you would hold her eternally in yours, remaining ever at work in her heart and life, even now directing her paths toward your good ends. God, as I hold John a moment in my thoughts, I ask that you would hold him eternally in yours, remaining ever at work in his heart and life, even now directing his paths toward your good ends. Amen. Prayer should not be intimidating. It should be accessible. And so with a tiny prayer like this, you can know whenever someone comes to your mind, you will have a prayer ready to offer up to God on their behalf. Or whenever you are asked to pray aloud, you can adapt a prayer like this and have one ready to give to God. Pray without ceasing. Amen.